Hello everyone, I am Burger, and I'm here with the video of Mountain Blade Star Wars Conquest. For those of you who don't know, Star Wars Conquest is a mod for Mountain Blade that makes everything Star Wars-y. So, you can fight Darth Vader on Coruscant, you can fight Princess Leia on Dak, and of course you can fight Jabba the Gut on Tatooine. There are three factions, the Rebel Alliance, Galactic Empire, and Cartel. I personally have my own country. Rebel Alliance Rebels. That's the automatic name. I'll change that later. But today, what I'm here showing you is a fight between 33 Sith, I'm sorry, 32 Sith, and 227 Space Pirates. Now, a lot, I have a lot of companions here, but if you see at the bottom of the list, there's 16 Masters and 16 Lords. 32. You regret ever leaving your army. So I'm going to fight them on Naboo. Nice, easy planet to fight on. A lot of the planets to fight on are rather cramped. Everyone, ready for battle. And I'm going to have them hold their ground until they get up here. So in this game, you can have lightsabers instead of swords, and lightning instead of throwing weapons. It's pretty great. It genuinely is. Instead of horses, you've got these awesome little bikes. And then, on top of that, I have my groups of infantry and archers. But then I've got, for three, I've got movement riders instead of, uh... Really? Wow. Okay. That could have gone better. That could have gone better. It could have. Well, I guess I have extra time to explain then. I'm gonna have them hold because this hill is super hard to fight on. It's time for a fight. So instead of cavalry, I've got Moomin riders because uh, these riders are riding the Moomin. That is the reason. Then for four, I've got strippers because uh, the Twilight female have their own class of troops. And uh, when you upgrade them, they ultimately become a Twi'lek Entertainer, which is uh, the strippers that Jabba had in his palace. I'll get, I'll give you more information on that later. Then I've got the Elite Jedi. I like to separate my troops from weak from strong. Beasts of the Abyss. That is the Rancors or Rancors. I'm not sure how you pronounce it. And frankly, I don't care. I only heard the word spoken once in the Star Wars movie, as far as I can tell. Which I'm. Um, means that I can pronounce it however I want. And uh, when you upgrade the baby rancors, they turn into mutant baby rancors. Not big rancors. Very disappointing. They never become big. And then I've got Jedi and Sith, which is the weaker um, Jedi and Sith. And finally, cool robots. I'm not including the lame robots in this group. The lame lo robots go in infantry or archers. This is the cool robots, like the assassin droids. Assassins. That's pretty cool. This fight is actually pretty easy. Now isn't it? It's because the lightsabers deal a lot of damage. In this game, the weapons deal a lot of damage. The lasers can one-shot you, and the lightsabers can certainly one-shot you. Also, everybody charge down. Make it a little bit harder on myself, because a battle advantage of negative two is extremely easy. Now, you can make a variety of different characters in this game. I personally have made a Wookiee who wears Boba Fett armor, has Sith powers, and uh, fights a lightsaber. A red lightsaber. That means you're evil. Everyone knows the colors affect your fictional concepts of good and evil. Whoa, how did I miss that guy? Well, whatever, the bike killed him. So yeah, about Jabba the Gut and his 
Twi'lex. So why would a big ugly slug be interested in like a humanoid form shape? That's kind of weird, right? I for one think that is highly weird. Cause that's the equivalent of a of a human being interested in a big ugly slug. And furthermore, the Twi'lex, yes. they've got something called Twi'lek dancing, which is a stripper dance that is named after their species. That's like there being a stripper dance that humans do called human dancing. That would be weird, wouldn't it? Yes, that would be very, very weird. So I imagine there's a lot of species throughout the universe, a lot of people in general, that have a Twi'lek effect. Yep. You piece of crap. Come on. Oop. So it must be some damn good stripping if, uh, if their species is named after them. Right? Must be. Unscrupulous charlatan. I don't know why I said those words. And it is hard fighting on the hill. Oh no! Vain Swag got hurt. I don't know who that is. I'm bad with names. I think that guy might be the guy whose face I can't describe because he's an alien. Yeah, that guy. Land and fight on Naboo. Ah, yes. Lots of, uh... Everyone is ready for battle. Sith on this. Battle advantage zero. That is a huge freaking advantage. I previously tried to make this video four times, but every time, uh, I bit off more than I could chew, and I could not defeat all of the space pirates because I accidentally and by accidentally I mean on purpose but I don't know why I did it uh fired a lot of my sin I'm not sure why I did that so that my army wasn't big enough to take on 700 or 500 so finally I attacked this group of 200 which seems to have been pretty easy That's one of my guys. Yay, I killed the hut mercenary. Yay, I killed a Jawa. I'm really happy about that. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of Star Wars. I've only seen the movies like once or twice. But uh I'm really loving this game. I like I like lore in general. I like the concept of lore. And uh, the Star Wars lore combined with one of my favorite games. Hell yeah! Oh, Battle Advantage Free 3. Free 3. It might, it's the same concept. Either way, I'm gonna get a bunch of free bodies! Whoop whoop! I get to eat them! Which isn't cannibalism because I'm a Wookiee! Unless, of course, I eat the Wookiees. Is that a Wookiee I see up there? Yes, it is! I'm gonna eat him! Consider yourself eaten, my good sir. Oh crap. Well, that happened. And see, now I've got no health. But problem solved, I'll just go to Station Inc., walk around the ship, Medical Bay, not to be confused with Michael Bay, and I stick my body inside this tube. <laughs> There we go. That feels nice. Stick my head in the wall like a reverse ostrich. And you might be saying, but Burger, wouldn't a reverse ostrich have feet on its head and head on its feet? And you're right, sir. You're quite sir indeed. You're quite correct. That is exactly what I am. A reverse ostrich. Yeah, the back to tank. Uh... Similarly, you can have this Bacta inserter or syringe or something and Bacta capsules in your inventory and when you press H, you'll heal yourself automatically. Isn't that great? 
It is pretty great. Not lemon at all. I dare say it's apple. Yes, yes, I regret leaving your, your, your army. So yeah, like, they're the species, the planets from Star Wars, but nobody really acts like, uh, themselves. Like, I've met Chewbacca, Han Solo, and Princess Leia, and Darth Vader, and they don't really talk like themselves in the movies, so. Or various other lore. And what's even less realistic is the stormtroopers actually hit people. Ever. So my thesis on why uh, why the stormtroopers never hit me is they actually the visors on their helmet, the goggles on their helmet, helmet isn't actually goggles on their helmet. It's actually the, it's the equivalent of wearing a bucket on their head. They're basically just wearing a bucket on their head. And that's why uh, the stormtroopers never hit anything. Is they're just wearing a bucket on their head. No eye holes. It just looks like it has eye holes. And I win! So let me capture my people. All mine now. Indubitably, good sir. Yeah, these are the lame robots I mentioned. Rodian warrior. Twilight female. Hire them all. I need more strippers. It's never enough. Because I'm making another video in the near future that will be about. What will it be about? The. What will it be about? Oh, right! Baby Raincores and Twilight Strippers versus Jabba the Gut. Access the item pool. Woohoo! Wookie Belt! I'm a freaking savage! Skin people! Whoopa Whoopa! Koopa Troopa! Ah, uh, yes. I came out of this stronger than when I began. Well, that's gonna be it for today, everyone. I hope you enjoyed. I certainly did. Today, 32. What are they called? Sith versus a number of pirates. I forgot what the number was. It'll be in the title. That's for sure. Maybe I'll even do worse odds next time. I think 300 would, would have been more appropriate. 350 max. Because 400 was way too much, but 200 and whatever number, 227 perhaps was the number, I'm thinking, was maybe a little bit too little. However, this fight was very entertaining. That's it for today, everyone. Bye!